Hey yo, what's going on guys? So yeah, today I just came back from Hong Kong, like literally just came back and I just finished shower and I just freaking finished packing all my stuff and I just gonna upload this video, alright? I hope this video can upload by the time I finish this, but today I came back and I not, I'm most likely gonna do a, a, a box review first because I want to upload this video just to inform you guys on what's going on. Firstly, if you guys are sort of surprised by my usual setup because really I'll be at this thousand something box over here because um, let me just say I sort of have have to clean my room because at one point it was super messy and so yeah I really have to do it so I just keep my design kind of simple now just gonna put two poker box set and one back on that and two bags on the side one here and one on the other end which you guys don't really need to know so um, basically when I went to Hong Kong things was a bit messed up alright it was screwed up it was fucked up I don't know because um, originally my plan was kind of change I was meant to go to um, um, anime fair which I ended up not going because at one point I realized there's not really any point of me going because I was like I'm just going there blindly and it's good squash with each other people and then it's gonna stay there and become all sweaty come out and then I will never get anything because I suspect the thing's gonna be super expensive and it's gonna be all cosplay and I'm not really interested in cosplay I'm only interested in figures which end up my prediction was correct because after my friend came back he said the things were super expensive and it was awful of cosplays and there was hardly any anime reviews uh, so but I did she did send me a picture of the 20th anniversary, uh, anniversary One Piece figures which I was at one point like no but then I do regret not going because on that day I went to shop for more figures so today I'll be telling you guys that um, I got a lot a lot a lot of figures to do all of you guys coming right up so um, um, most likely I'll be doing them in sort of the, uh, in the, in the more precise order this time because the last time when I went to Hong Kong and I came back I did it in jump out order and I even messed up a few videos and I even forgot all of a few videos so hopefully it will mess up again this time so um, the last time when I went I got some I got majority of the army figures and mod and except for the Kakashi and uh, yeah except for the Kakashi I'm just looking at my figures right now literally up it's literally up there uh, except for Kakashi uh, the rest of the figures are fake so if you guys don't know, I most of the video, the figures I collect are fake. But this time when I went to Hong Kong, I just didn't say let's stop the fake shit because let's collect some real figures. I mean, what's the point collecting fake ones? I mean, they look shit. And I came to realize at one point, yeah, I do agree they look shit. And, and I don't regret going to Hong Kong this time because when I go to shop, I actually found the golden One Piece Go Luffy with the with the axe. Wait, just give me a second. I'll be back in a moment. I just had to grab something really fast. Alright, um, back. Alright, uh, another ship camera. And in, ga in case you guys can't tell, because in, in case you guys can't tell, oh my god, my pronunciation, but never mind. In case you guys can't tell, my stand broke. So literally now I'm using tape. To tape my phone on my stand literally the stand is not working because the last time I broke it and I used a super glue a super glue to glue it and then it end up stuck on the the extension end up being stuck onto the stand as well and it's not able to extend any further for my phone to fit in so literally I can't do anything with it it's just a broken stand right now I'm just using tapes to tape on it Anyways, back to the figure I was talking about. Uh, in the case you can't tell the little figure with the axe and uh, this sumo type dressed out with the word go at the bottom. Um, yeah, this was the one I was talking about. I actually found this for 45 Hong Kong dollars, which is around 20 ringgit. And I was like, what the fuck? Are you serious? I'm not joking. It's actually real. It's legit. I checked the price tag itself, but I forgot to buy it. I was like, oh no. It's kind of sad that I didn't buy it was depressing but I end up buying something else which costs even more and it's not as cool as that but anyways um alright so I it's actually 45 Hong Kong dollars which is around 20 or 30 ringgit here and I tell you when I bought okay I'll, 
I'm driving to Minato now. It's gonna be risky because Minato has been stuck there for quite some time. I'm just gonna like put the like the one piece over because yeah, I'm gonna show you guys something. Alright. So this is Minato. In case you guys can tell, right? Minato fell down. Uh, Minato, um, I bought him in Malaysia and he looks really shit. Looks like the hair has popped out and the eyes look kind of weird. And this cost about 20 ringgit and the design was fucked out as well at the back, which kind of regret. I kind of regret buying him later, but at at Hong Kong, I found an actual figure for this for 20 dollars. And it's legit and I didn't buy it and I didn't buy it. I'm not joking I actually didn't buy it. I was so depressed and what I was like I don't know but it's okay I got other figures to show to you guys but what my, what my point was trying to what what I was trying to refer to was that buying figures legit figures at Hong Kong is super worth it it's so cheap I tell you I can buy a real latest One Piece figure or any other anime figure. I'm not sure about any other anime. I'm just talking about One Piece to all One Piece fan. I'm not sure about other figures. Let me remind you, I'm not sure about other figures. To all One Piece fans, I can buy a price with a price of a fake figure in Malaysia with a size like this for a One Piece figure with a size like this. I mean slightly higher because my, my phone is shit. I can't even show it to you guys. It's around it's about uh 20 20 30 minute centimeter and it's legit. I'm not joking. It's 40 over ring only. It's so cheap, it's so worthy that I really love it. Okay, so um I guess things really fucked out. Yep, I went to the point about anime fair and I want to to get some figures from there, so I told my friend to help me get it, but she said it's too expensive, so I said it's okay, never mind. I don't regret not going because, yeah, I got some other figures to show you guys. So, yeah, I guess that's the end of this video. Um, I don't really have anything else to help you guys because the next video I'll be uploading will be the figure review, and I'm most likely I'll be doing straight after this video. And I hope you guys do enjoy this video. Um, please subscribe if you don't. And oh shit, uh, give them another. And yeah, bye. See you in the next video.